Okay, we're gonna go over the left box drill. Essentially, we're gonna be doing eight steps forward, eight steps to the left, eight steps backwards, and eight steps to the right and hold. So first couple things here, this is about a 45 degree angle here, okay? Now when we march, our feet will be parallel. So uh, just know that we're gonna try to keep our feet parallel as we march. Even when we start crabbing, which we're gonna go over later, we're gonna try to keep our feet straight. Okay, don't try to point them in, in any area. Now we're gonna take eight steps forward. So first we're at a 45 degrees in our feet, and now we're gonna go straight. So you're gonna take your heel and flex your feet as high as you can, your toe as high as you can, and then you're gonna roll through. You're gonna push through in the back. I'm not gonna to get too specific. I just wanna see you march, okay? We're gonna to try to keep our legs straight. We're gonna swing through and take our other toe through. We're gonna do this eight times. Three, four, five, six, seven. When we get to eight, we're gonna do something called towing our stop. Okay, towing our stop. Let's say we're on five, six, seven. Now here's eight. We're actually gonna point our toe and stop ourselves like a break. Okay, that get, lets us stop our momentum and now we're gonna to push to the left. When we push to the left, I'm gonna use this line to help me here, okay? We wanna make sure that our heels start on that line, okay? Whatever line we're on. And we're gonna to try to keep our heels right there so our left foot will go back a little bit as our heel stays on the line. So even when we cross, keep that heel on the line. And we're gonna get up on our platform. You'll see this from this angle. Okay, so uh, I'm, here, I'm here towing my stop on count eight. You'll see now both heels are off the ground. So even when I take my first left step, which is behind slightly, I wanna keep my heels off the ground, okay? Then I cross, when you cross, you're gonna to tend to cross small, try to cross hard, and try to get as big a cross as possible. Also, if you can see my shoulders, I'm trying to keep my shoulders parallel uh, and straight to where, where I'm facing. So my arm shouldn't turn to the side like this. Okay, or keep your shoulders square, okay? So let's try this. So we have one, cross, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, okay? So from here, we're just gonna take our left foot back and stay on our platform and don't let your heels fall, okay? So that, again, your right foot stopping your momentum. So you see your right foot on count eight is most of the problem. On count eight, that's always your change of direction. So that's your most important foot is count eight, stop your momentum. All right, now we're going backwards. Stay on your platform. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So again, on count eight, well, I'm falling down. On count eight, you have to stop your momentum. Now, so again, when we're, when we're going backwards, our feet are parallel, okay? Don't let the angles go out like this or in like this, keep everything parallel, okay? When we are crabbing to the right, again, we want our right foot to be, our right heel to be on this line, our imaginary line here, okay? So we have parallel feet. So you're coming from here, then your left will cross automatically in front. Your right is still on that line. So one, two, See my heels on that line, my left slightly in front. All right, so I'm transitioning from backwards march to right crab. Here we go. Cross on one, two, three, four. Keep my shoulders straight. Six, seven. On eight, I've got to really, ooh, I'm falling. On count eight, I've got to stop myself. And then we're trying to finish how we started with the 45 degree. To, degree. So make sure that your right foot is starting to hit that 45 degree angle and then you're going to slowly pull your left foot in calmly don't just fall down okay make sure you you take a lot of control here and, and try to end slow okay so i'm going to do this all in order here we go 45 degrees one two one two ready push one two three four five six seven toe the stop one two left's behind right's in front five six seven push backwards one two this is all straight leg five 
six, seven, eight, cross in front, left's in front, right cylinder back, five, six, seven, hit your 45 and don't fall, be calm on that landing. Okay, so you're gonna have to do the left box drill while playing timing, number one. That's only, and no tag for that. So you don't have your drum probably, so we're gonna have to do some different things. Maybe we're just gonna count it out loud. Maybe we can fake it in the air and maybe we can play it on our chest, okay? So I'm gonna give you an example of counting it out loud while you're marching. You will not end up playing any tags. It's just the first uh, five measures of timing number one which would be measure, it would be check A, check B, check C, check D while you're doing these. It should work out with, if every measure is four beats, that means you're gonna do check and a variation for every direction you're going. So in other words, for the first eight, here we go, one, two, ready, go. One E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a one E and two E and three E and four E and one E and a two E and a three and a four E and a one and a two and a three and a four and a one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a one E a two E a three E a four E a one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a 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 stop. Okay. So the last one is your foot is going to be on the rest. E and a, E and a, E and a, E and a stop. So that was basically the example of counting it out loud while you're marching. Uh, I could also, you could also play it on your legs or your chest, and I'll try to do that example as much as I can with this microphone. All right, I'm sure it looks silly. Here we go. One, two, ready. Five degree at the end, calm landing. I'm sitting here looking goofy for you. So hopefully you use this video. Let me know if you have any questions in the comments below.